Hey guys, it's me, Bilal Ahmad, and I would like to start from a precious and prominent greeting. Islamic greeting, okay? Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Hope you guys are fine and doing great and living with a great dignity and a delightful life and wishing for something to be successful and touched sky by your succession. Well, guys, let's come to the topic, okay? The one thing which were bothering me and which were seen not so good to me and I think I must have to make a video on that is that basically you know i met with many people and i have many friends you know and what they are telling me whenever i meet with them they are telling me i'm following that personality like take an example of Jordan peterson which is a doctor a psychologist which is very famous in united states of america maybe some people are telling me yeah perhaps they are telling me i'm following that personality somebody gonna tell me i'm following elon musk because i want to be a billionaire some people are telling me yeah I'm following the personality which name is, um, which I forget his name by the time, but you know, which is quite famous, the founder, uh, the founder of Microsoft, uh, Bill Gates, yeah. Some people are telling, yeah, I'm following Bill Gates because I want to be a genius. Yeah, it's fair, okay? It's your life, you are following the personality, but let me make you clear. Let me make you clear. The thing is that which is quite important, we must have to understand. You guys knows better, you know, everybody have different ability, different personality, uh, different strength, uh, which depend upon their health and maybe something else, different situation, different strategies, and these all. And if we combine these all together, we can find of the immoral that we can decide who we are, basically, you know. Maybe these people, like if I take my example, I can't follow a person which is actually living without discipline, you know. And maybe by their own discipline they are living, but I'm a sick person, so what should I do? I must be careful about my health first. Because the health is a first priority, and we must have to go a priority to the thing. If I'm healthy, I can do whatever I want. But if I am not healthy, what should I do? I will be not, I will not be able to do my work, even, you know, my normal and general and common work, which I must have to perform, you know, on the daily basis. I'll never ever be able to do it. So why I'm telling you? Because everybody have different ability. Whether we, we gonna see, you know, with regard to their health status, with regard to their abilities, means maybe they're having abilities at all, but we have to search on their behalf which kind of ability they have and according to the abilities we're going to decide for them you know we're going to decide for our own self yeah i have these kind of abilities by working on these all i'm going to be reached to a peak point where i'm going to be have a title great person maybe some people having the abilities to be the great athlete some people have the abilities to be the genius of the town some people have ability to be inventors some people have the ability to be a great speaker some people have ability to be scholars of the religion these all depend upon what your abilities and you must have to search on your abilities if you didn't search or you doesn't search or you never search in your entire life your ability search it today be committed to that if you search your ability found your ability work and then that's going to take a later time not too much but if you don't have the ability of something and still you're saying something like oh I'll become like Bill Gates. I'll become like Elon Musk, Jonah Peterson, uh, maybe somebody else you're following and you want to be like that, but you never saw your ability. These people have some different kind of ability. They've been through some situation where actually they felt that, yeah, we have these ability, we have to work on that, then we're going to reach to that position on which we are today. So what I'm trying to make you understand in myself too, because I want to be successful, I want to be happy, I want to be generous to other. I want to be compassion. I want to be having sympathy. I want to be have a great integrity title. And these all, from where I come to me and from where I gonna get these all? Well, I gonna get it all from somewhere where I think by working on my body, by pushing my body power, uh, you know, giving a little bit heat to my body, warming my body for that. Yeah, I must have to achieve that. I must have to work. And then, then I'm going to be somebody which going to have that title for the life, you know. Don't you understand? You understand, guys. I know it's better, you know. So, and the first priority is that, you know, we have to 
you know think on our body whether we are healthy or not we whether we have the abilities or not whether we can achieve or uh, come to that position or not whether we do work on our our personality on our abilities then we're gonna take it all or not so first we must have to go through that after than that that's gonna be our decision whether we want or not you know and the greatest personality which First and foremost, we must have to follow is the Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessing be upon him. Whether you are a sick person, a healthy person, a good person, a bad person, or whatever it is, by following that personality, you're going to become somebody generous, healthy, wealthy, honest, having great titles, amazing, on the peak point of the world, on the top of the world. You're going to be saying, oh, oh, that's shocking, you know, that's shocking. First and foremost, if we are following somebody, leave them, you know, you must have to follow. Being Muslim, the Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessing be upon him. Even the non-Muslim, if you see, if they followed the Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessing be upon him, they studied the Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessing be upon him. Today they are claiming. The one personality which I ever signed my entire lap, to whom I got influence, got reflection, you know, that was Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessing be upon him. And if you see the most influential person of the world, the history is the prophet Muhammad peace and blessing be upon him. What, what, what the reason? He been through the situation where he showed to the people that how much generous, how much actually passion he had, you know, at that time. And he had been through this all every time, every day he passed, you know, he passed the situation where actually they went to the to their enemies. The people were which supposed to be their enemies wanted to threaten the prophet moment peace and blessing be upon him but the Allah ordered them at that time go to that person blah 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 these all the person were showing to the prophet moment peace and blessing be upon him that you have to go there reach them call them to worry islam whether they want or not just your uh, your uh, actually your responsibility is that to call that person if they want to come then yeah here they go if not then it's been thrown from your side and now you don't have any more responsibility well i'm not a scholar so i'll never go deep in there but i study the prophet muhammad peace and blessing be upon him not at all from the beginning to the end but being a muslim yeah i studied him you know as far as i'm concerned i have quite good information about the life of the prophet muhammad peace and blessing be upon him and i'll never talk because that's something unique that's something very we must have to come to that you know very carefully uh, because that's related to something somebody believes so we don't have to make some astonishing claim something which actually not fair so the thing is that first and foremost if you are following somebody follow the prophet moment peace and blessing be upon him and believe me you're gonna got surprised when you are going through that just for a month you know you're gonna say wow i got something yeah these all the successful person how much i've been through these all you know how much i wore the videos and i saw the people like elon musk if you see if you see them you know watch their videos their discipline search and google what the discipline of elon musk and these all you're gonna find oh these people are going to the bed early night you know early evening you know after after it or something early night and wake up early morning like 3 a.m or something or 8 a.m or a p.m or something they are going to the bed what was the reason because they are seems to be you know they're understanding at that point line you know on that spot you know that we are going on through uh, go through that we're gonna get something in our lab which gonna be our succession and we compare these all to the prophet muhammad peace and blessing be upon him alive he actually taught us that go to bed, the bed how much early you can after praying your last prayer after evening you have to go to the bed and actually lie down and wake up at early morning to remember your god do meditation and these all the thing and if you see the modern era people are saying that's the discipline for the succession so don't you, don't they know about the proper moment, peace and blessing be upon him, what he did, and how much he goes through these all the situations they don't know, but still they find out, you know, by research on these all. And finally, they are saying that that is separate. Nothing else, guys. There was something which I was giving to you and wanted to gab to you, and finally gab to you. Now you have to think whether you want to be successful or you want to be a loser in your life, whether you want to go on discipline or you want to go on your life, whether you want to go. And follow somebody which actually having different abilities, strengths, and capabilities, you know, 
mm, or you want to go somewhere, the personality which had been through the situation, which is the rule model for our life, which is the prophet Muhammad, peace and blessing be upon him. What do you want in your life? Don't you want to be successful? If you want, here we go. We're going to go there. We're going to reach to that peak point. We're going to set. Now I read that position. Here we go, guys. Nothing else. Thank you for watching. It's a it's a very lengthy video, but hope you guys are gonna watch it. You know up to the end, and you guys are gonna support me. If you like, you have to click the like button, share with your friend, and subscribe. The most important, okay? And for now, 